Well, Tom, pregnancy can bring a lot of changes to a woman's body, and one of the parts of the body most affected is the heart. Now, sometimes it's hard to tell what's normal and what's not. So the Fox Medical Team's Beth Galvin explains what's going on and when you need to worry. The heart has to work harder during pregnancy because your blood volume goes up by 30 to 50 percent. So you may notice things like a fluttering sensation or the feeling that your heart is racing. So we asked a Wellstar Kennestone cardiologist what to expect from your heart when you're expecting. You're pregnant and you feel like your heart is racing. Is that normal? Wellstar Kennestone cardiologist Dr. Mindy Gentry says the answer is typically yes. Very commonly, pregnant women will come in with palpitations or feeling like their heart rate's beating fast or hard, and, and oftentimes that's because it is. Gentry says it's normal for a woman's heart rate to go up by 10 to 20 beats a minute during pregnancy. But less than 10% of the time, she says hormonal changes that come with pregnancy can trigger an abnormal heart rhythm. So when people come in complaining of high heart rate or palpitations, we have to decide is that normal related to the pregnancy or is it an abnormal rhythm? that's been worsened or exacerbated by the pregnancy. Many pregnant women also experience a drop in their blood pressure. Which can lead to dizziness and lightheadedness. And so trying to hydrate well, make sure you stay very well hydrated is very important to try to prevent that blood pressure from dropping low enough that it causes problems. Staying on top of your blood pressure is important because a rise in blood pressure could be a sign of a common, more serious pregnancy complication, hypertension. And women can also experience a spike in their blood sugar sugar, known as gestational diabetes. Either of those two things um, do increase the risk for development of cardiovascular disease after pregnancy and really for, for decades after. If you're overweight, not exercising, that increases the risk significantly. For that reason, get as healthy as you can and get active before you start trying to get pregnant. And then stay active as long as you can. And if something just doesn't feel normal, Dr. Gentry says, get it checked out. And Dr. Gentry touched on this, but the studies have shown that preeclampsia or high blood pressure during pregnancy and other pregnancy complications can raise a woman's risk of heart disease later in life. So if you're having any of these issues or you've had them during past pregnancies, talk to your doctor about ways you can keep your heart healthy going forward. I'm Beth Galvin for the Fox Medical Team.